All right, today I'm taking a look at Ardbeg 10. Love this whiskey, 92 proof, no caramel coloring, non-chill filtered. This was made hugely popular by Jim Murray in the 90s and 2000s. This was a mothball distillery for about 10 years in the 80s, brought it back on that strength. Um, again, 92 proof, 10 years old, uh, no chill filtering. Checks all those boxes. You can see it's a relatively light color, but it's very deceiving because it is just a knockout um, smoke and barbecue and saltiness. Uh, the malt itself is very light. It's really just a delivery system for the flavor of the peat. A little bit of light honey sweetness you get in the malt, but then right away, boom, you're hit with a wave of smoke mostly reminiscent of like a, a fire that you would have on the beach that's just been kind of smoldering for several hours and you just get little whiffs of it here and there that's what this smoke is uh it it's got a little bit of salinity to it as well and then you get kind of this kind of like a smoky meat kind of barbecue flavor as as well so i think this would be great with barbecue and also make some really cool cocktails because of the amount of smoke ardbeg tin quite legendary bottling Still just as good as it's always been. Cheers.